super cool party people and welcome to Sunday. I had the weirdest dreams last night. Um, one, there was this sphinx, this giant sphinx. It was inside, I don't know if it was like inside a building or a pyramid or whatever, but legend had it. It had six treasures in it and um, nobody could find them. And I found like on a compartment on the side of the building like the inside of the building or whatever it was, the wall, I found like a note <laughs> that directed me exactly to the first treasure and so I found it and then so I was trying to find the other treasures but I assumed that there would be a note to find the other treasure, like the next treasure in that spot but I couldn't find it but I was like, well, I mean it's probably just in the other paw because I think it's where the first one was. Weird. I had another dream where I was like walking and walking and traveling and there were snakes and there were mountains and there was so much going on and I was vlogging it. <laughs> I was like, gotta get these shots. Um, don't know what I was trying to get to there. And then I had another weird dream, like in a building, in a, like a really luxe mansion, I think. I don't remember quite the details on that one, but lots of weird dreams last night. Cool, cool, cool. It is currently about 10.30. I've been awake been awake and aware of what time it is since about 10. I had a great sleep. I did not want to get up. I um, just laid in bed forever and it was great. But I'm going to make myself breakfast now and then I want to probably get some invoicing done. And then I have to pack later because once more I'm away. I'm not too far this time. I'm just going to puppy sit for Jessica's parents. So it's like up the street but it's fine, I still need to pack because I'm there for like a week and a half and that is the final thing that I'm doing this October and one of the reasons that I think I'm only in my own bed for like 10 days this month which is stupid. Anyway, I'm gonna get up and make myself some breakfast soon and then start to try to be a little, a little bit productive today. It has been so many hours, I'm still in my pajamas, I have been laying in my bed doing nothing. I mean I fed myself and then I just laid in my bed watching YouTube videos. It is now after 1.30. <laughs> I'm the worst. Um, I'm gonna get dressed and then I'm gonna start, I think, piling stuff to pack. I've got a couple vlogs that I edited yesterday to upload and um, then I wanna be productive. But I have a massive headache and my neck hurts. That's <sighs> what you probably get from staying in bed for so long. But hopefully I can get some stuff done. I don't think I'm going over until like after seven tonight or something. I gotta figure it out. But. I should probably start thinking about packing in the very least. Okay, so it is about 20 after 3. I have finished packing except for my backpack because I need to put my laptop in there and stuff. But mostly I'm good. I'm having myself a giant plate of fries for lunch. Is it lunch if it's through? I don't know. I've, my eating schedule is off. I finally finished binge watching The Good Place. So I'm caught up to date. So now I don't have that to distract me. So that theoretically means I should be able to be productive. I did manage to upload two vlogs while I was watching it, because um, that's a great thing. It's basically like having two monitors when I use my TV. And so after I eat, hopefully I'm gonna get into invoicing, because I'm feeling like, I know I'm not that far behind and I know it won't take me that long to catch up, but I'm feeling really far behind. <sighs> and the more I put it off, the more I don't wanna do it. Anyway, so food productive, maybe? Fingers crossed. I'm not sure what time I'm going over. Like I said earlier, I think around 7, but I don't know why I have that number in my mind. But anyways, progress is being made and that's all I can ask for. I'm not gonna lie, I am dying a little bit. I've just decided to open the invoicing and oh my god, I knew last week was bad because I booked a lot of those charters, but oh dear, dear me. So <laughs> I um, spent an hour on it. I got one invoice done and I got like a lot unpacked because I had to group a bunch of them together and figure out who was with who and blah 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 and I just sent this huge list of questions to my boss, it's like 10 questions and I'm like, this doesn't make sense to me, like we dropped off here but we never went back and picked anybody up there or we didn't drop off here yet we picked people up there from the same group that we dropped off elsewhere so just like clarification and stuff. So my brain hurts so much but... It seems less scary. The problem is it's like it's all the same company this week doing all the runs. So just, ugh, it's a lot. Anyway, I'm making myself dinner right now. It's 6.30. I've got my suitcase packed. 
and my food e-bag packed and I just have to put this stuff in my backpack with my laptop and this as well but I'm not too concerned about it I feel like I have no idea when they're gonna call or text ah, to say they're coming but I feel like I can grab and run pretty quickly if need be so that's exciting I'm also bringing workout gear because like I'm pretty sure they still have their treadmill and I wouldn't mind ch -ch 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 running so anyways that's the plan uh food first though I'm not super hungry but I know I should probably eat Alrighty, and with that it is the end of the night it's like 11 30 I'm in my room they're just finishing their packing because they're out of here at like four in the morning crazy and yeah, thanks for coming along to today's adventure. I'll see you tomorrow. We'll do very similar things. Good night.